It's a beautiful morning. It's a wonderful day. Walking with Jesus. It's a beautiful day, and I'm Pastor Johnny. I want to speak to you today about implements of righteousness. Romans chapter 6 and verse 13. Do not continue offering or yielding your bodily members and faculties to sin as instruments or tools of wickedness, but offer and yield yourselves to God as though you have been raised from the dead to perpetual life and your bodily members and faculties to God, presenting them as implements of righteousness, glory to God. Do not offer your members, do not yield your hands, your feet, your thoughts, your abilities, your word, to as instruments of unrighteousness, hallelujah, as tools of wickedness. Now, we don't do that. We don't yield our bodies as tools of wickedness. We do not partake in sin. We do not perpetuate sin. We do not hear a wicked story or a story undermining somebody else and we go and tell it and perpetuate. Do not yield to that and yield to uh, telling stories of unbelief and repeating um, bad things that happened and, and ugly things and wicked things. They do not come from us, but here he says, yield your members as instruments. I love that word. Implements, hallelujah, of righteousness. Glory to God. Your hands are implements of healing. You lay hands on them and they heal. Hallelujah. Your mouth is an implement. Hallelujah. Of life. Speaking words of life. Hallelujah. Everything about you is an implement in the hand of God. Yield yourself today. Lay hands on the sick. Hallelujah. Raise the dead. Open blind eyes. Speak life. Re release the fragrance of Christ as we yield our bodies, as we yield ourselves. Saints, you're an implement of righteousness. You're an implement of kingdom life. I bless you today as you bless others, you minister to others, you pray for others, you intercede for others, you speak life into others, you encourage others, you lay hands on whatever it is, be an implement because through you, God's going to establish his kingdom power today. I bless you in Jesus' name.